Okay, the secret to how you can get your salvation back after you've lost it. Okay, because you know there are a lot of people out there teaching that, well, you can lose your salvation. Okay, so now if, you want to, if you've lost it and then you want to get it back, what you've got to do is take your left leg and put it next to your left ear. And then take your right leg and put it next to your right ear. And then kiss your butt goodbye. Because there's no way, according to these people, that you can regain your salvation. And they'll use Hebrews 6 to make that point where it says, for it is impossible for those who were once saved and have tasted the, the good word of God, if they shall fall away and be, and lose their salvation, to renew them again unto repentance. So it's impossible. At, you know, if, you, if you're saved and then two seconds later you sin, that's it. You've lost it, and there's no way to ever get it back, according to these uh, grace haters. All right, so uh, there's just two things I want to point out here. Um, let's see if we can find it. Oh, no. I think it's abound. All right, so moreover, the law entered that the offense might abound, but where sin abounded, grace did much more abound. So these guys obviously clearly hate the grace of God. Right. And then I want to point out this uh, gentleman here. Uh, he points out a great verse. Uh, here's one that confirms we are in him and he in us. 1 John 4, verse 13. Hereby know we that we dwell in him and he in us because he has given us his spirit. We didn't take his spirit. He gave it to us. And so obviously... Um, once you are saved, you're saved forever. And it's just so unfortunate that those people who say they are saved say that uh, they can lose their salvation. They must live every day in absolute fear and torment. Uh, but Jesus says, And I give unto them eternal life, and they shall never perish, neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand, my Father, which gave them me, is greater than all, and no man is able to pluck them out of my Father's hands. So, just like this gentleman points out, that he is in us, and we are in him, and because he has given us his Spirit. So, he's in us because he gave it to us, and it's just too bad, man. You're stuck. Once you're saved, that's it. And whether you want to view it... Everlasting life is hell. That's on you, buddy. All right. Once saved, always saved.